your answer. <laughs> Isn't that what it's asking? Read the question yeah, again. Read it again. Question, how does your family feel about your parents? Guys, so we're doing the interracial relationship tag. I found an article online that has some questions that you're not supposed to ask interracial relationships and then I guess some questions that you are. Just so you guys know, I don't even know what she's about to read, so expect whatever's about to come out of my mouth. First question, what is your background? Black. That's it. <laughs> That's it. You could, well, no, what do, you, what do you want me to tell you? What do you I mean, I was born in Canada. Uh, my mom was, um, is from the islands. My dad is from the islands. But if we're talking about interracial relationships, I mean, I, I, I'm African. Like, that's yeah, it. Yeah, but like you're Trinidad. Like your background's like Trinidad. Yeah, but we only got to Trinidad through slavery. So <laughs> I'm from Africa. Okay. I am half Japanese and half like white, just like, I don't know, like Scottish and Irish white. Bet you guys didn't see that coming. Um, yeah, I don't know. A lot of people just think I'm just like full Asian. Some people think I'm like mixed, but I don't know. Look at my face. It's not like my eyes are pretty small. I don't really have very white features. Yeah, and she's Asian on her mom's side and Irish on her dad's side, so. So what is your favorite food of like the other person, like the other culture? Sushi. Hold it down. Bar none. The sushi. Japanese- What well, kind of sushi? What's, what's your favorite? Mackerel. Mackerel, mackerel sushi? Yeah, I actually had that. It was coming around when we were in Japan on the- Oh yeah, you yeah, did. Yeah, I was switching it up because- Did they, I have that or no? You were destroying the salmon. Yeah, I know. I you like destroyed the salmon. I love salmon. This is the next question. How does your family feel about your partner's race? Do you want to go first? Sure. Oh, yeah, they're chilling. I mean, they're chilling. Uh, <laughs> what? Uh, well, let's. Well, no. Well, they have no problem with you being Asian. I'll answer the question as it's been asked. They have. <laughs> they have no question with Leah being Asian. That's your answer. <laughs> Isn't that what it's asking? Read the question yeah, again. Read it again. Question, how does your family feel about your partner's race? All right. She has no problem you, with you being Asian. Yeah, and my family uh, has no problem either. They just don't care as long as he's a good man. And he's taking care of me. <laughs> and it's all good. Flex. <laughs> You're dating an Asian. Aren't you worried about, and then you add in a stereotype. So what stereotype is there for Asians? I have like three stereotypes for Asians. Well, I never get, isn't she smart? I think that's the <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's a stereotype. Aren't you worried about her being smart? Why would you worry about- No, that's what I'm saying. No, I was running down the line. I'm like- I, Oh, I like don't really I don't get that stereotype. That. No, not that you don't get it. It's just that I know that stereotype, but it's not like people come up to me like, Oh, you're dating an Asian and she's smart? Like, no, I don't get that. So- What about- Oh, okay, I got a good one. Like, you're dating an Asian. Aren't you worried about her like- like crashing your car because like Asians are bad drivers. Stereotype. Oh, but you can't drive though. I am the stereotype. Yeah, yo, yo, Leah can't drive. Like, no. And she like goes with uh, the minute she's driving and like an eighteen wheeler pulls up beside her or any big no. vehicle, she just like. That's because I had an accident where I was facing an oncoming like 18 wheeler and I don't even really know what happened because I like blacked it. It all happened so fast and then I like pinged like a yeah. little ping pong into this guardrail. Luckily it was there, otherwise I wouldn't be here right now, but. Yeah, but you do be approaching stop signs going like 60. And then you I'm trying break to like two going. feet away. <laughs> <laughs> You're dating a, I guess, black guy. Yes, sir. Um, aren't you worried about stereotype? Yeah, what kind of stereotype do you get about this kingship? Mm -hmm. I want to hear this. What kind of stereotypes have you heard about my Are you people? worried about um Oh you blank. Oh, no, <laughs> I felt like it was so much easier to think of like Asians because I'm Asian so I'm like off the top of my head I know what people have said to me. Yeah. But I'm not black, so like I don't know. Wouldn't it be easier to just date your own race? 
I can answer first. Go for it. I have actually never been with an Asian, like, ever. So I'm just not, like, I don't know. I, I'm, Le like, stuttering, but, like, I just... Leah has outright told me from the jump she has no attraction to Asian males. <laughs> um, and when I first heard that, I was, like, kind of taken back by it because it didn't really add up to me. But she has no vibe for them. Like, yeah, I don't know. No vibe. It's not my preference. Everyone has their own cup of tea. That's just not mine. Black. Wouldn't it be easier to just date your own race? I mean, technically, yeah. It would. I don't know. It's, uh, yeah, it would, but, um, <laughs> yes, it would because of certain cultural things, but I mean, I vibe with you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, okay, I could have met somebody else who was of my race that I would have maybe been easier to date in some felt some realm some aspect i don't know like i don't know i don't know i don't know how to, like i know what i'm thinking about but i don't know how to answer it but i'm just saying okay yeah i could date somebody of my race probably a lot sooner in life or i don't know not sooner it says wouldn't it be easier, easier like yeah later? i mean like huh how do I, i'm trying to say it but I feel like I'm thinking before I'm saying it because it's all mashed together. Okay. Okay, it would have been easier just because. Like you know They the get, same. they just get like. The, like that, you've been brought up under the same kind of like household yeah, rules per se and like the not attitude, the same culture. Thank you, see how you help me see, see what I'm talking about? <laughs> the attitude, the approach and everything is just very similar. Yeah, right? I feel like Black people are more open with their feelings and they can just talk straight out and just literally talk about whatever if they have a problem. Japanese or like Asian people, they don't do that. If they have a problem, they just keep it inside and just shut up. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, there's sometimes I'd be telling Leah how I feel and she'd be like, oh, this is happening right now. Just yeah. because like, there's just no filter. Just gotta let people know how you feel. Yeah. <laughs> think of the children. Aren't you worried they will be bullied? I think that's a ridiculous question. <laughs> yeah, who's gonna try and bully my oh boy? You just saying my future child will not be bullied. You know what I think the question is because oh, like you'll get called like half breed and and stuff like that. I get that now. I am a half breed. But you I'm don't a look like a half or a mutt, whatever you want to call it. Like a black and knees. Like if it's a boy, you're gonna be able to tell. If it's a girl. You might not be able to tell. You probably will. Kind of like Maybe. you. Like you can't really tell with you. But your brother Sean, you could tell. I don't know. I think he looks pretty Asian to me. <sighs> Do you only date and then insert your ethnicity? But like, we already answered that in the other. These questions are kind of like the same. Wait, no. Yeah, I insert think I ethnic. That. Oh, so do I only date black guys and do you only date Asians? Yeah. No. I don't no. only date black guys. No. I just don't date Asian guys. <laughs> Leah is actually my, the first Asian girl I've dated. Yeah. So. He had a thing against Asian people before me. Yo. You know what? He had a bad experience. A bad one time. experience. Like Very a really, bad. like, yo. Yeah. And basically, uh, long story short, happened at a very young age. And it turned out the kid was Chinese and he was letting me know how he felt. And obviously we we're so young, he definitely got it from his parents. He doesn't know what the hell he's talking about. But because I was so young too, I just generalized all Asians as being that type of way. Until I met her mom. And her mom was like, no. <laughs> I do not feel that type of way. So, yeah, that definitely changed in that regard. Don't you get frustrated not being able to express yourself in your own language? I don't because I only speak English. <laughs> yeah, oh, that Ma hurts. Oh. But <laughs> <laughs> that hurts. He was actually talking about this the other day. We went to the cottage. He's like, I wish she spoke another language so we could speak French right now. And I'm like, yeah. well. Because I get bored speaking blah, English blah, blah. sometimes. <laughs> it's just like, it's kind of, it gets boring. Um, but the thing is that would like trigger me about that. It's like, okay, so I speak English, speak French trying to pick up on this Japanese, but I speak 
no African, not any of the, God knows how many African languages, I know none. Jesus. Yo, that hurt. That hurt. Feel <laughs> Damn. it. Damn. Pain will make you grow. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Eight. You say that every time I say this quote. <laughs> You're just like, yes, that makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Light at the end of the tunnel. I was in a dark place just now. Was, Jesus. I don't know. Damn thing. <laughs> Appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, no problem. Do people stare at you when you go on dates? I honestly have never ever noticed that, but I think if anyone would stare at us, they would stare at our height. Cause like, he's like two heads taller than me and I'm, yeah. well yeah, two heads shorter than him. Yeah, well, Leah, how tall are you? I'm like 5'3". That's what she likes to tell people. <laughs> she is not 5'3". I'm, I'm, she might be 5'3 in some five heels. Three. No, and like he was like five five. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, all right, six three. So you get yeah, huge difference. Yeah. Um. Okay. So, how did you two meet? Um. We actually answered this in another video, but we just met at school in English class. No. We didn't? No. What? No, we didn't. <laughs> Why? Where did we meet? We met in our anthro slash uh, psycho uh, anthro uh, physiology and sociology class, and we had a supply teacher. Oh, we met there first? And we went to the computer lab. Oh, yeah. And you came in late, and I was like, oh, you can sit beside me. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's like no <laughs> spots at the computer, and I'm like, oh, I'm late. And all we did was go on Facebook and talk the whole time. Yeah, that sounds about right. What is your favorite part of your partner's culture? I don't feel like I know that much about your culture. Oh, you slept Oh, I think, I think dancing, for sure. Like, I don't know how to dance, but I love to dance. Like, they love to dance, and I love to dance. If I could only, like, move it properly. Like, he always tells me <laughs> I have no rhythm. I'm like, mm, mm. Yo, cause Leo will hear the most amp track and then she'll just bust one of these just... <laughs> <laughs> Like, yo, why are you like twitching fam? Like put yourself together, but um <laughs> They're very 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 polite people like extremely polite people and like oh Boy, they're clean as hell clean as hell especially like in japan like check out our japan videos to hear me talk about how there's no dirt anywhere there's no garbage anywhere there's no nothing anywhere they're clean. yeah they literally have someone that's job is to just pick up gum on the side of the street like that's how clean it is anything drops like someone will like come out of nowhere like that's a fact. And, and clean it and scrape it you see him like scraping it into a little dustpan like, and takes it away oh my like, that's wow. a fact like i was setting up my drone on a bench and i got up to go put the drone away from the bench so it didn't have anything in front of it when it took off <laughs> and i turned around and these ladies were cleaning the seat that i was just sitting on <laughs> Like, oh yeah. Yeah, like uh, clean, clean, yeah. clean, clean. Okay, so I guess this is our last question. Do you speak the other person's language? French? No. I can say Hi. <laughs> Deshka. Uh, oh, Deshka. What's that? I don't that? know. I don't you know. I'm just throwing way. them out here, like. <laughs> no, you remember? Do you remember how to say my name is? Shoot! Oh, you gonna put me on the spot? Damn! <laughs> Damn! No. What other ones do you remember? So you gonna keep the spot going? <laughs> like, <laughs> well, cause you at least know some. I don't really know um, how many French words. I know like, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf, dix. I know. Okay. Hi. That Which means what? Hi? You guys say what? I'm, hi like, means yes. Okay. Uh, Daijobu means like, um, like don't worry about it or like leave it alone. It depends on how you say it. It, it, it varies. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. 
with that. Uh, like I said before, uh, uh, Onaji Mono Kurasai. That's, I used that when I was asking for like another drink at a restaurant. It's like basically kind of another one. Those are the ones you always get to have yeah. I'm like, cerveza, por favor. <laughs> <laughs> I got that one. That's the only Spanish I know. Cerveza, por favor. That just rolled off your tongue. That's how you can tell you just use it all the time. <laughs> I do. Here's another one. Um, Ila nai. And what does that mean? That means no thank you. Yeah, kind of. Like, I don't want it. Yeah, I gotta want it. And, uh... That's all I got right now. <laughs> That's good though. That's good. I'm holding it, it was down. a while. We went to Japan like a couple a while ago, actually, maybe six months ago or something. But how do I say my name again? Watashi wa. Oh damn! Watashi wa Manny. <laughs> Watashi wa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess that's the last question. Yeah, I hope that helped you guys like get a little insight of our interracial relationship. Um <laughs> Anything else that you want to like fill in? Because um, it's like a geared question. Like, how do you feel being in an interracial relationship? Are there any differences or do you even notice it? Okay, I feel like I, 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 I got a better question. I've only you. ever been in interracial relationships because I, I, I don't date Asians. That's a fact. Oh. <laughs> should have caught that. Yeah, I actually, that. Well, how is it different for you? That's actually a very good question. I I have no idea what it's like to date an Asian. Yeah. I wonder if it'd be easier. Maybe it would be. Who knows? In some, um, in some ways, I could see how it would be for you. For me? Yeah. Because we're both passive and don't want to argue. Yeah, <laughs> but like you're very like Western, so you're like yeah. aggressive as hell, and you'd love it's to my get Irish your point. Spicy side. Yeah, like you would love to get your point over, and then there's me. That's like, ooh, this is. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you know too, and then there would be the Asian guy that'd be like, hi, 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 <laughs> <laughs> and would just like revert into himself. But no, I'm not like, saying every Asian guy is like that. Not no, but you dated a black girl before. Like, was it easier dating a black girl or like dating other races? Because you've also just... dated other. <clears throat> you dated like every race, haven't you? Damn, you gonna put me out like that? <laughs> <laughs> like. No, I'm just ooh, saying. Ooh. <laughs> ooh, okay, yeah, actually, I think I. No. Not Indian. I've though. never been, yeah, with a subcontinent Indian. I've never been yeah. with like a, a Punjabi or a, or a Sikh or a Hindu mm -hmm. or. But you I know Punjabi is a language. Black, white, Asian. Um, Latina. Really? Been there. It must have been young. I don't know about that one. Yeah, it was young still. It was young. When uh, the black girls and women that I have dated, there was a lot of things that made it easier. And there's a lot of things that it's like when you're too much of the same, then it's like. It clashes. Excuse me. It's yeah, true. I can see that happening too. No, that never like just that never pushed me away from black women. That was just like you just crash, you just clash with people, and it's just mm -hmm. like okay, boom. Then you run into somebody else who you're vibing with, and you're like okay, boom, that's working. It's really not up to whatever color the person is. It's just how well you connect with them. Flex. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we're gonna end our video now. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for tuning in, and um, stay tuned for more of our awesome videos to come. Don't forget to subscribe and like to see more of our interracial relationship and more lovely things about us. Yes. And leave lots of comments because I like reading them. Lee well, loves to read your comments. <laughs> and I respond back to them too. <laughs> she does. She will not leave you guys out to dry. Thank you for tuning in. See you next time.